What's up guys, it's your boys Awoki back out with another rant video. And this one, I'm definitely excited about talking about it. I wouldn't say necessarily excited. I was excited because I got a ticket. A lot of people got tickets for the new Spider-Man movie that just got released last night. But ridiculously, these tickets have gotten one button in multiples. Obviously because people are saying they have families. But then they're also stating that oh i can't go to it quotations so i'm going to sell it on ebay for five to ten to twenty thousand dollars for a set of two to a set of four tickets and it's ridiculous on scalping of these tickets we're going to be taking a look at ebay facebook marketplace also why are they saying some of these places are sold out when my own movie theater is not even sold out of these? We're going to be taking a look at this rant right now. So guys, grab a chair, grab some popcorn. And we take a look at the sales for Spider-Man No Way Home and how this was a pretty much a disaster when it comes to these websites as well. Let's take a look. If you guys are new to my channel, if you guys are returning and have not subscribed yet, make sure you guys subscribe down below by hitting that red bar icon down at the bottom right. Turn on notifications by hitting that bell icon next to it. So I do post videos like this one. You're going to get that little ring notification that's will keep myself has posted that video. And then you guys can watch, comment, like, and share. And again, I say this on every video, but thank you so much for the support by subscribing, commenting, liking, and sharing. I surely appreciate it. Every single one of you guys, we're growing to 10,000 subscribers together and we'll grow even more past that. But make sure you guys tell your friends and your family and make sure you guys comment down below. Hashtag scalpers must be stopped. We've been talking about scalping when it comes to computer parts, uh, video game consoles, sneakers, and now, of course, movie tickets when it comes to the release of Spider-Man No Way Home, um, which happened last night. I myself did get tickets, but I'm actually going to use these tickets for my brother, myself, and my son to go see Spider-Man No Way Home. But for some reason, I was not able to get in right away. Right at midnight, obviously, myself and thousands of others tried to get into Fandango, tried to get into the actual websites that, like for me, it's Marcus Theaters, Warenberg, C Cinemax, or not... Is it Cinemax? Cinemax? Yeah, okay. And um, AMC, a lot of these websites that were able for purchase of these crashed within seconds. They were overloaded. And the last time we saw this one was pretty much when we had um, Rise of, the, of, the, of Skywalker for Star Wars, Avengers Endgame, and Avengers Infinity War when those websites actually had those crashes because of ticket sales. And of course, we, we knew this was going to happen when Spider-Man No Way Home was available, the the, um, the websites crashed. So I was not able to purchase mine until about an hour after the actual website was refreshed and I finally got my tickets. But the lo and behold thing, I couldn't believe this, I watched a TikTok, they were literally stating that these tickets are getting scalped in some locations that have been sold out. But if you guys look at my actual um, theater, I have th three theaters in my town that's next to me. If you guys look at the theater, everything that's black or gray is occupied. This doesn't look sold out. I'm sorry. But if you even went... So I'm going to the 635. That was the 1010 version of IMAX. If we went to 635, not that bad. There's still seats available. Even if you go down to the 3 p.m. version. Are you kidding? And then even if you went to the other ones, the 4, the 735, the 5, the, the 8, or even all these other ones that are in IMAX theaters, they're not sold out. So I honestly, honestly think that maybe some bigger towns like Austin, Texas, or New York City, or um, Sacramento, um, California, those places maybe are sold out. Maybe premieres that are big movie theaters, whatever. This is a good thing for movie theaters. Don't get me wrong. We've had a lot of problems with trying to get seats filled since COVID, but having this definitely gets those movie theaters back up and running, back up and having the, filling those seats, getting some uh, popcorn and pop and, and some candy, getting those um, movie theaters so they don't shut down, which this is something that we want to keep 
because all these other businesses have closed because of COVID. And we were kind of worried about this when Song chi came out, Black Widow came out. A lot of those movies, not saying that they didn't do very good, they just didn't fill the seats as much because of COVID. And maybe this is a pro- possibility that some of these seats are not filled completely because of COVID when they could have been filled a lot more. But why is it if you go to eBay or Marketplace these tickets are going for ten or five to ten to twenty thousand dollars. I'm not joking. I'm literally. I've seen some people offer. I've seen people that are watching. Some people are not are bidding. Some people are not. But who in their right mind would purchase two to three to maybe four tickets for ten thousand dollars? I'm not. I'm not even joking. Look at this. So looking right off the bat, if you type in Spider-Man tickets, it takes you to $10,000 offer. If you even read them, some of these people are stating, oh, I was gonna, I was planning on going to this. I just don't think I'm gonna go anymore. So my loss is your gain. Say what? My loss is your gain. You're gaining two tickets for $10,000 and that's his loss? If anybody in their right, this has to be a joke. I'm just stating. I'm looking at some of these. Even like some of them might be okay, which is not okay to scalp. But like this one, two tickets, Hollywood Thursday at five sold out, which is understandable for $200. That is not that bad. Okay. I'm not saying give the scalpers what they want. No, that's not it. I mean, for me, I bought three tickets. It cost me just under $52 which is still a little high for me because back in the day when I went on a date back in high school, I could take out my girlfriend at the time and spend under $20 for two movie or two movie tickets. And that was like opening night. So this is decently priced for scalping, not saying giving them the benefit of the doubt, do not support them because this is ridiculous. Even if you look at down below this, you see $2,500 for two tickets at AMC Burbank 16, or the screen 16 first showing. Down below this, this one right here, two tickets for $100, that's not that bad, okay? I mean, depending on the location, which is uh, Fresh Meadows, not quite sure, in Queens, I'm guessing that's in probably um, uh, Pacific side, no, not Pacific side, Eastern side. I could be wrong. I'm not quite sure, but hundred dollars is not bad, but still do not give these scalpers what they want. But down below that Rosville, California, you see $20,000. Are you flipping kidding me? If you click on it and look it up, go down to the description, Spider-Man No Way Home, blah, blah, blah. Four tickets available for premiere showing at the Galleria movie theater at 10 PM on 12, 16. I bought these for myself, but if someone is willing to pay this amount to see it, I'm okay with that. L O L. I can't tell if this is the joke, if this is sarcasm or if he's legit being like this and he don't care. If we look at another one, Click it, look at the description. For sale, two tickets in the middle of the theater. Great seats, you're gonna have a great time. South Bend, Indiana, AMC Movie Cinema 16, and they want $10,000. What? If we look at another one, let's go to a reasonable one. It's not reasonable, but it's still decent right here. Spider-Man No Way Home tickets, Orlando Park, Marcus Theater, 1017 at 310. That's all it says. So if you go to some other ones, let's see maybe this one right here. Looking at this one. Go down the description. Spider-Man No Way Home tickets for Saturday. Um, LA exclusive. Whatever the hell that means. Does not mean you you can charge $1,500 for tickets. Um, down below this, we have $5,000. Still not acceptable. Spider-Man No Way Home tickets, um, Finland, Ohio. Location... 7 p.m. Two tickets. This is the way. I, I I honestly can't tell if these people are trying to rip you off. If this is legit. If they're making fun of this. If they're joking. $250 each. This is not the freaking Super Bowl here. And speaking of Super Bowl. they Tickets should not go for that much. This is scalping on a whole nother level. Scalping for Xboxes was between 2 to 4 
thousand dollars at most there was one maybe at ten thousand which was ridiculous in itself but these scalpers or people think that these people are going to spend ten thousand dollars on two tickets here's another one spider-man no way home 4d what the frick is 40 isn't that i don't honestly know what 40 is chicago december 16th 15 grand free shipping oh thanks because it's probably digital still. Um, Spider-Man No Way Home, 4D, Chicago 4 tickets, and Prime Theater location, row E, seats 3 through 6. So he purchased 3 tickets. For 11 p.m. showing in Chicago AMC on Western, or Western Avenue, December 16th, tickets will be delivered via screenshot. That sounds like a scam in itself. No free funds or returns. Please, if you are watching this video, do not subject yourself to a scam or purchasing its tickets. You can wait a week, two weeks, three weeks if you have to. Some locations are not even sold out yet. Some are sold out, yes, but not all of them. So take your time, look for the right tickets. Do not go on eBay purchasing these tickets and giving scalpers what they want or scammers this is ridiculous okay i thought avengers endgame's tickets were bad those were between five to a thousand dollars and i was gonna make a video back then and i just did not decide to because i wanted to be positive when it came to this movie i'm still keeping positive for the people that are actually going including myself i am so excited hopefully you guys are too definitely comment down below if you guys did get tickets and you're going with your fiance your husband your boyfriend your your girlfriend, your kids, your your grandparents, whatever have you, I want to know and keep it positive. But this is ridiculous when it comes to scalping. Literally, they should make this not happen. There's no way that this should be allowed. There should be a cap where they cannot go or exceed $300. eBay should impl implement this. Uh, Facebook Marketplace should implement this. Um, all these third-party selling kind of companies should make a cap on certain items so they know that spider-man no way home is coming out okay do not sell it more than 300 do not sell the xbox more than 500 do not sell the gen 3 series graphics card more than 800 dollars. there is tools to make this possible i i I still want to know if this is a joke, if this is sarcasm, if this is real, if this is... I, I'm i looking at these. Some of them, they'll put LOL. Some of them say, yeah. I even texted a guy. I wrote him. I was like, are you seriously selling these for $10,000? He's like, yeah, it's $5,000 a ticket. I said, are you serious? Yes, I'm dang serious. All my, all my movie theaters around me are sold out. And that's it. He would not respond to me afterwards. I'm at a loss for words when it comes to scalping. Scalping has to stop when it comes to tickets, sneakers, electronics, consoles, movie or Super Bowl tickets. It's ridiculous anymore. And I don't know what else, why they're not doing anything about it. Honestly, Sony's not benefiting from this, from $15,000 a ticket. It's the consumer that's reselling it. Am I wrong? I want you guys to comment down below. Tell me if, if I'm wrong. Do you think this is okay? Do you think this is wrong? I mean, comment down below. Like the video if you like my rant. Do not, I wouldn't say dislike the video because it obviously doesn't count. But comment down below if you guys are pissed about this or pissed that you guys can't get tickets because of your area and then you can't get purchase them unless somebody else is purchasing them for like three to four to five to six hundred dollars or thousands of dollars for no reason. Yes, this movie is big. It's very big for anticipation. We can't wait to see it, but not for five to six to ten to twenty thousand dollars. Not even three hundred dollars. You shouldn't be paying more than a hundred dollars for two tickets, or three or four or five. It it shouldn't be done. Do not give any of these scalpers. Like I said, comment down below. Like the video if you guys like the rant, and if you guys are excited for Spider-Man No Way Home, I am super excited. And we'll see you guys in the next video. So keep it real, keep it safe. And as always, keep nerding on. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.